Hey, we're recording. All right, nearly gave the game away then. All right, it is Boxing Day. I am in my shed at the moment, and you can see we've been absolutely flat out. So this just gives you a little bit of an idea uh, of the mayhem that has been going on at Birdwood Guitars at the moment. There is just, there are orders freaking everywhere. Um, okay, it's, it's yeah, it's been it's been pretty good. But one of the things that I'm currently working on at the moment, you'll see the Dremel sitting there, is something with these F-holes. And I actually made this template. Um, and we're going to be doing a lot more of these videos of, of ways to build and things that I'm building at the moment. Um, and you can actually see, this is a template that I've made. And I want to show you what I made the template from, because this is the only damn thing that this thing's good for. <laughs> Do you recognise that? Yep, that's the $27 Aldi cigar box guitar. And it's made out of cardboard. And, well, look, let's be honest. Um, there's a lot of cigar boxes out there that are made from cardboard too. Um, these ones here, excuse the craziness. These ones here, these are made from cardboard as well. And I do use those, but I do line them with Tasmanian oak to make them sturdy that's all these are good for all right so if you do want to find yourself a, a relatively inexpensive f-hole template um, <laughs> go and buy yourself one of these kits for about 27 bucks well wait till they go on sale because um, that's about all they're good for um you know it's at the end of the day oh, let's look I've done videos on these things before, and, and frankly, if people are getting into it for the first time, um, and they go and get get themselves one of these, then cool, but I think you, you pretty quickly find the limitations of these things. Um, you know, anyway, so what we've done is I used that to create that template, and this is the box that I'm using at the moment, and... Turn that back on. And she's beautiful. There you go. And uh, I'm just going to move this one back. Just a touch, because I just I'm not quite getting that last little bit there. There it is. All right. Safety first. I always pop the battery. Excuse me, I'm going to pop you down for a second. Ah, look at the roof. It's amazing. There we go. Sorry. I always pop the battery out of these things when I'm not using them. So let's have a little look. Could have been a complete disaster, but. I don't believe it has been. There we go. And that, once I give it a little bit of a sand around the edges, that's actually come out really, really well. So there you go. Little tip. Use one of those. Make yourself one of those. And you can do one of those. All right, Adam at Berber Guitars saying, see ya, bye.